Hey, what's up, Nerdgasm fans? Jerry here, a.k.a. Barnacles, and welcome to Barnavlog, day three in New York. Well, I'm at the World Maker Fair registration in New York. Just picked up my, my credentials. Yeah. See, I didn't write Barnacles on there because I'm all incognito, you know, so none of you guys can find me here because none of you know what I look like. Oh my god, Master Chief, can I get your autograph? Yeah, sure. Oh my god, dude, I didn't realize you're so scrawny under the suit. <laughs> yeah, it's all, uh, all That's brains all in here. Man. It's all the brains? Your brain's driving that exoskeleton? Oh yeah. You don't need muscle. You got like the exoskeleton. Yep. Oh, look at this. We're going into the, what is this, like the private secret sponsors only area? I feel so special. Hey, does that sponsor pass make you feel pretty special? Oh, it does. Special. Absolutely. Yeah, very special. Absolutely. <laughs> How's it going, man? Welcome to the vlog. This is Stefan here. I'm Steven. Or Steven, sorry, my bad. <laughs> That's all good. Probably, probably learn how to read. No, anyways, <laughs> uh, first, first guy, I think, first, first I don't yeah, know who you're like, first my, my first fan. Yeah. They found me at Maker Fair, and Maker Fair hasn't even started yet. I love it, thank you, man. Yeah, I you got it. it, I love your video. Wow, that was really freaking cool to just hear, you know, a couple of minutes getting set up, and somebody here who's an exhibitor already, like, recognized me and said he loves my stuff. That's cool, that's like, that's that's gratifying and makes me want to keep doing this. So I'm here at the Ulti Maker booth. You can see we're in a big box here, and there's our tent, and we're getting set up. And just for clarification, guys, I do not work for Ultimaker. They actually flew me out to New York because I make a lot of videos using their printers. And they really like what I've done with it. And they like my community and they love you guys. So they flew me all the way over here to New York, put me up in a hotel, been paying for my dinners and drinks and everything. I mean, they've been awesome, completely awesome. And this has been more of a vacation than a business trip. And uh, I'm looking forward to working the Maker Fair with them. Well, it's been several hours since we've arrived here at Maker Fair to set up the Ultimaker booth. And as you can see, we're making huge progress. <laughs> they gave us the wrong booth and now we're moving right and there's george george is running the show right now hey george yep sitting around for four hours so hopefully we're moving to a new location with uh with taller things and flatter ground so we can actually set this thing up everybody thinks we're all set and then they realize no no we're not all set yeah let's play this yeah maker fair likes to make a lot of assumptions apparently it's all right we're gonna get there though we're gonna build this thing we're probably not gonna go home until 4 a.m but it's okay, no. we're gonna build it. And I'm gonna get some pizza later. If I don't get pizza within the time span of this vlog, I am gonna be very, very disappointed. You're getting paella. Paella. Well, that's a start, but I need pizza. I need that New York pizza. Big old New York greasy pizza. Yeah, I'm yeah, doing it. Better. Well, we finally got a new home at least. <laughs> right? All right. Things finally. are going fantastic. Hey, weren't we supposed to be done like a half an hour ago? Yes. And now we're just moving our stuff into there. And I almost got ran over by a forklift. Well, at least our new spot is a lot better because literally on the other side of the wall where Ultimaker is, they're actually selling Ultimakers. And they're not selling Ultimakers. They just got a booth showing people Ultimakers so we can just send people around to buy an Ultimaker. It's genius. Time to go check out a neighbor. Oh, that is cool. That's very cool. It's Lobster Mobile. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Everyone needs one of these. If everybody drove one of these, there would be no road rage, ever. <laughs> Dealerships, if you're watching this, this needs to be an option on every automobile you sell. That is awesome. Oh my God, what possessed you? Well, once you have the idea, how can you not do it? True story. All right, progress is being made. We have the first giant crate open. Yeah. Well, we're almost sort of starting to look like a booth here. Let's put everything up This first. huge display is in three monstrous segments, but they decided to unbox the chairs last because they were afraid I'd just sit in them if they took them out first. Yeah, you know. Arm is trying to become a construction worker here. Starting to get late in the day. We're supposed to be done literally hours ago and we're just getting started. And then on Sunday, we gotta box all this back up in these huge shipping crates to send it back. Uh, it's gonna be a lot of work. I'm starting to think I should have told that Sander guy, no, I'm not coming to New York. I'm gonna stay at home and play video games. <laughs> but but I'm here, so I can't do nothing about it. So it's all, it's all good. All right, 
we got everything, well, not everything set up, but we're getting there. We got things in cases and Ultimaker set up and got this. And the most important thing here by far, the absolute best thing by far here, right there. Yeah, I'm not biased at all. All right, let's see here. Oh, this looks good. And have you seen- Like a mouse, what? Oh, in, the, in many parts now, Ronin. Oh yeah, yeah, and we got we got Ronan the the broken robot that Aaron's trying to save. <laughs> yes, a casualty of the London print show. Yep. Damn you, London print show, and drunk <laughs> people wandering around knocking <laughs> stuff over. It's all right. I'm confident it'll get it fixed. All right, it's food time. Food, 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 food. Siren to the food, food. Well, we took a little break to get some food. We're just waiting for the paella to finish. Apparently, they're cooking paella for everybody. I've never even had that food before, so I'm just taking a moment to walk around Maker Fair and look at some of the stuff. It's kind of cool. Got the Popcade. Space Brazil. Nothing good can come of this. These are great game names, by the way. Crystal Brawl. Field One. With the Xbox controllers. Particle mace. This looks promising. Ooh, that's actually kind of cool. Got some pinball. Night of the Living Dead and a mini arcade machine for the little people. I have no idea what that is, but it looks like it's going to be something cool. Wow, this is pretty cool, guys. Check this out. It's a little uh, marionette driven by servos. Yeah, no, from a distance when I was looking at it, it caught my eye. I was like, ooh, that thing's moving pretty fluid. It's got that, you know, because the marionettes have that fluid movement to them. That's fantastic. Now, Ultimaker makes a pretty good printer, but sometimes you need something with a slightly larger build volume. <laughs> like 18 feet of build volume. That is insane. Disco Dragon, we meet again. I'm sitting here eating some paella and drinking my beer with my peeps. I swear they're my peeps. They're not just random people I sat down with. It's getting late, but we're just sitting around drinking some beers and finishing up because tomorrow is the first day of Maker Fair to the public. Yeah. 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 This thing is so awesome. This is taking 3D printing to a whole new realm. And there's a gun, America. <laughs> yeah, and it was created. It was created by Aaron, who's the only Indian in the world named Aaron, <laughs> and we love him. Yeah, that was actually all printed on an Alti maker. It's Masterbot, not to be confused with. And this is drunk Beardosaur. I am not drunk. He are drunk. I have just had several free beers at the awesomest place. It doesn't come yes. free, right? It's -a me, Mario. I like to step on turtles, yeah, and eat mushrooms. I'm a bad influence to children. All right, so George 3D printed a gear, a functional gearbox, a manual gearbox. Transmission. So let's go ahead. What are you in right now? Six. It's overdrive. So the handle yep. is gonna go around. Well, this will go around once, and the handle won't have gone around once. Here yep. we go. Go. So you're gonna watch that top thing, and yeah, the broken spinning really. Yep. There it is. There. Yep. The handle hasn't finished. We'll do the opposite. We'll do first gear. Or should we do reverse? We'll do first gear. Turn off. You got to lock some brakes in place. Turn off the back right. brake. Let me make sure it's hitting. Okay. Okay. So we'll start with it straight up. So watch how many times the handle goes around. Yep. One, two, three, three and a half. Yep. Three and a half. That's cool, man. Well, guys, we got the booth all set up. I've lost my voice. Oh my god! Right before Maker Fair, when I have to talk to people. So I hope it's better in the morning. Um, I'm back in my room. I got my PJs on and uh, I wanted some water and I found out that the ice machine also dispenses really good tasting filtered water and uh, or I can buy it for two dollars a bottle. So I was like, uh, how do I get the water back to my room? Well, I took the ice bucket and literally put the liner in it and just filled it up with water <laughs> and brought it back. And I'm just I'm just ladling water out with my little little disposable cups. And it seems to be doing a good job, but you know, that's, that, that's hydrating on the cheap. So I'll take some of that money I saved and uh, I'm going to get takeout tonight. Well, I ended up ordering the Angelo's pizza. And as you can see, I, uh, I ate quite a bit of it. The tummy is full and it is late and I'm going to go to bed because I need to get some real sleep because tomorrow 
It's day one of Maker Fair. I gotta wake up at 8 a.m. It's already midnight, so I'm already past where I get eight hours of sleep, but I will settle for seven. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, hope you guys are enjoying these vlogs. This has been an awesome uh, adventure. I've pretty much lost my voice. I hope it comes back in the morning. Otherwise, tomorrow's gonna be a pretty rough day, but eh, we'll see. So good night, everybody, and until next time. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please take a moment and subscribe to my channel. It helps me a lot. Also come over to Twitter. I'm at Barnacles. I'm a real social guy. Also, if you have a couple of minutes, check out some of these many other videos. I made them myself. <laughs>